Hi, I'm Eric Kimball, author of the Planet Whizbang Idea Book for Gardeners, a copy of which I have right here in my hands. And today, in this video, I am going to demonstrate for you an idea that is in this book. This is an idea for creating a rainwater storage system using 55 gallon drums and something that I would wager you have never seen before in your life. And this is it right here. This is the amazing Steve Lonsky U-shaped siphon tube. With this siphon tube, you can connect any number of 55 gallon drums into a rainwater storage system that works so that when you fill one barrel in the system, and, and like I said, any number, we could have 50 barrels in this system, all connected with the siphon tube. And when you fill one barrel, with water, the water level in all the barrels automatically goes up at the same time. Likewise, when you draw water off from one barrel in the connected system, the water goes down in all the barrels. It maintains a level, the same level in all the barrels. This is amazing. It borders on paranormal, but it isn't paranormal. It's uh, physics, I guess. It's a simple siphon put to practical use. And I'm gonna get behind the camera now and I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna show you what I've got and then I'm gonna show you how it works. Okay, so for demonstration purposes, I have a full barrel of water on the left. I've added red food coloring to it. And I have a totally empty barrel on the right and we have our siphon tube there. The siphon tube is made out of one inch electrical conduit, PVC conduit. And down there on the, uh, gosh, we just went blurry. Down here, we have a drain. You would need a drain on your uh, system to get water off of it. But uh, what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to charge the siphon tube. Okay, to charge the siphon tube, you fill it with water, which I've pretty much done here. I'll add a little bit more. Uh, you can see we've got, got it, it's coming out this end over here. And then I have a paper towel inside a plastic bag, and that's gonna be my cork. I'm going to plug the ends of the siphon tube once it's been charged with the water. And I'm going to reposition the camera so that you can see me lower this in. I'm gonna flip it over so it's no longer a U shape. It's an upside down U. I'm gonna drop it into the barrels. I'm gonna pull these plugs out and the siphon will start. Okay. Here I am, the plugs are in place. I'm holding them with my fingers. I'm gonna lower this down a ways. And then I'm gonna pull the plug out with my right hand and my left hand. It's a bit of a trick, but we can do it. There we go. And then we'll drop the tube all the way down and we've established a siphon. There you can see the water's coming in to this empty barrel and it's going down in that barrel. Okay, so the water has leveled itself out automatically. The siphon has done all the work. And now to show you how um, it works with filling, I'll add water to the barrel on the right and we'll see what happens. Okay, I'm gonna stop right there because this is well water and uh, I don't wanna run my well dry, but you got the idea. I could keep filling here right to the top and that one would fill right to the top also. And every other barrel in this system connected with a siphon tube would allow the whole system to go up and down. You got the idea. Uh, the finer details of this are explained in my book. Yes, of course, I think you should buy one. and. Um, you can buy one from me at planetwhizbang.com or you can uh, buy them on Amazon. They're there too. So that's the idea. Uh, the applications are limited only by your imagination. 